You know, I'm passionate about leveraging my experience to help other leaders. I feel so fortunate that throughout my career, I've had positive mentors and coaches that have guided me and helped me be the best that I can be. And now I want to do the same for other leaders. I've sometimes worked a little bit more on the strategic side, sometimes a little bit more on the execution side. And I've done it at three companies, Procter & Gamble, Novartis Consumer Health, and Darden Restaurants, who do this really well. I think the, the, the biggest value proposition that uh, we bring as coaches is an uh, extra set of experienced eyes that have walked down the path that leaders are walking down now. So we can help leaders see things that may not be as obvious to them. I've been an engineer, I've been in marketing, I've been in finance, I've been a president, so I've been on many sides of the table. And I think, uh, you know, that I know that gives me an empathy and understanding for the challenges that leaders face. Having the best talent and having great talent is the key to any organization. And so finding that talent, uh, I encourage CEOs to always know who is in the industry and have an eye for someone that they might like to pick up at some point. I encourage them to interview continuously, whether they have an opportunity or not. You'd be surprised how many times when they find a good candidate, they're willing to bring them into the organization. So it's not about looking for someone when you have a need. It's about looking for great people all the time. The most rewarding experiences for me have to deal with results and the belief that comes when the results are achieved. Through my entire career, I've been fortunate to have mentors and coaches, and the benefit that they've been is this, for me, is that they see things that I don't see that aren't as obvious to me, and they tell me. And it's non-judgmental, which is a key, okay? Uh, it's non-evaluative, and you know that they have your best interests at heart. And those have been the most valuable relationships because they've helped me see some, some blind spots, both in terms of how I was leading the business and opportunities to be more effective from a leadership standpoint.